So many graffiti writers here, bro. It's amazing. Yo, this terrible T kid, 170, boogie down Bronx. Oh, uh, the European final? Beautiful work, beautiful work. And it was like, one of the best ones I saw. Festival? I stand it. I stand it. It's like, you got a little bit of everything. You got skateboarding, you got rapping, you got break dancing, you got parties at the end, you got graffiti. What elements can you copy, you know what I mean? It's, 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 it's great, it's beautiful. The Right for Gold Festival is held in a lot of cities throughout Europe and now it's starting to be including uh, the United States and the rest of the world. How many watch out? We're gonna come on top. Um, we had about, right now we had about 20 events in, in three months. Position, how you can read them, how they swing, how they flow, you know, how you put color in them, and how they work with everything. For you to get good points, you also have to score good in the sketches, you gotta score good in the throw up, and you gotta score good in the, in the tag. You know, those are different categories that you compete on. Doing the wall, that's the, that's the last thing. You have to score good in everything so you can win the whole prize, man. Nobody really talks about it, it's the toilets and the condition of the toilets and uh, what the problem it is. <laughs> For them to bring all so many people together and just for the culture, man, that's such a great thing for the culture. You can't stop graffiti. Graffiti's never going to stop. It's going to be around forever. Graffiti is the oldest form of art, you know, and people need to express itself. And graffiti is the ultimate art of expression. Hard, cool vibes that are on is the best of the best uh, that these gentlemen right for gold could find. Today, the, uh, the European finals, beautiful work, beautiful work. And it was like one of the best ones I saw. You know, and what it's about is, you know, trying to get the best uh, writers from that particular city or area or country that they have on um, the finals at and then those that win their, for their country it's like the world cup elimination round today is going to be even tougher because today you got all the uh, all the other teams from the rest of the world Auckland uh, United States South Africa you know it's real interesting to see what they're going to come and bring to the table man Man, no one wants to lose, so like I'm glad we won. Like